Hi everyone, we are going to see what is coming through for your reading today. By the way, if you hear any noise in the background, it's, it's raining. But I always find that rain is super therapeutic. So if you like rain, I mean, you're probably not really going to hear much of it, maybe. But um, it's just what's happening. So this reading is for all star signs. If you're here, it's a sign in itself, I feel. And we're gonna take a look and see what's coming through. Also, just wanted to mention that if you would like to win a free reading with me, all the information is down below in the description box. Personal services are listed down below as well. And also on my website, shopmoonlightguidance.com for personal tarot readings, rituals to manifest different areas of your life, healing work, prayers, and also the black magic energy removal. There is also the... Um, <laughs> intention items, intention items on my website, which thousands of people have seen results with. They are super special because they are the various areas of your life and they're just really lovely because so many people have seen results with them and it just is so heartwarming, honestly, you know, to over the years to have just seen so many of you have these amazing results and also I just wanted to mention as well that you know there's items like bracelets, necklaces, anklets, pom-poms, tassels, embroidered cards which you can put under your pillow, your wallet, your purse, candles have been restocked, there's the teas and there's also the sage bundles and also the review section for that is at the bottom of my website. All right let's have a look and see what's coming through here for you. I feel like oh gosh does anyone else get this where like there's a certain hair that's just pulling and then it pulls Oh gosh, <laughs> it just pulls everything. All right, That's a little bit better. Hmm. You know, your past in regards to your love life has not been so great. Um. And, oh wow, oh wow, okay. So, regardless of what's happening in your life right now, um, regardless of what's happened in your past, I think this reading is really interesting because for those of you that are wondering, you know, is there going to be someone better that comes my way? You know, is, is what I have right now for my highest good? It really depends if, you know, obviously if you're um, married and you're very happily married, then I don't really think this reading is going to make a lot of sense to you. Um, it's there's, you know, no real, real point. Um, but for those of you wondering about new love, you know, those of you wondering about whether someone better is going to come into your life than those that you have experienced in the past, the answer to that is a very strong yes. It is a very strong yes. You know, some of you are in situations where people right now are treating you super hot and cold. They're not being very nice to you. They are being, you know, push pull this that. You know, just you know, very kind of all over the place, they have their own stuff to like heal and figure out and, you know, I mean, you know, that's that's a whole situation but what's really interesting is that on the cards, which I'll show you in a second, I clearly see that there is going to be new beginnings, okay? So what this means is that you're going to have an option. For those of you that are already dealing with someone or, you know, you have your eye already on someone, there's actually going to be a new person that comes your way, which really just makes your head turn. This person is super, um, like, very um, outgoing, but they're also very family orientated. They are very kind, genuine, attractive, you know. That, that also is one of the things that I'm seeing here. Of course, you know, physical attraction is not everything, but I definitely feel that they are very strong. And when I mean strong, yes, they can be physically strong, but I actually feel here that they're strong internally. They have worked through issues that they have had. They've worked through difficulties of the past. I do believe that people have done them wrong in the past as well. And that Seven of Swords is coming through to really explain that because there's no other negative cards here. Um, and this Seven of Swords here shows that they've done their own healing based off, you know, their difficulties, their struggles, but they are such a strong person and they're so giving and loyal and they would never treat you badly because they'd never want to be treated badly themselves. So, you know, the universe is like, don't ignore this person when they come to you because they really can be very good for your soul and your energy and, and what you actually want overall. But then again, it's your choice, right? So for those of you wondering, okay, is a new love going to come my way, you know, or is what I have in my life right now the only thing that's going to exist? Oh no, new love is absolutely going to come your way and turn your head. Whew. <laughs> yep, turn your head. Turn your heads will roll. Heads will roll. Okay, so we've got your judgment, 
yeah, it, I mean, you're going to be thinking to yourself, wow, I did not expect you to be here. Um, and they'll be like, yeah, I am here. So we've got very strong Venus energies, okay? So they're going to be heavily, heavily ruled either by Taurus or Libra. Now, when I say ruled, I mean, you know, sun sign, moon sign, or rising could be a Taurus or a Libra. And that's also indicated here as well. So yeah, they're ruled by Venus. So they're very soft, you know, they're very soft at heart, but still very like strong, you know, strong willed. Um, they can stand up for you. They can stand up for themselves. They can, they can stand on their two feet. They don't run away from issues, challenges, problems, struggles. They fight for things to, to work, you know? Then we've also got here as well, the Hanged Man and Ace of Swords and Eight of Wands, Magician and the Queen of Cups. All right, we'll fill in the gaps here as well. Now, what is very important is, well, that almost became an ASMR moment. Uh, what's very important here is that we have got the Ace of Swords. Now, the Ace of Swords is very important because this clearly goes to show that this is a new um, option, okay? New option, new person for you, someone to consider. They're very intellectual, they're very smart, they have got some good money, okay? So they're financially very, very stable. They can also have their own home from what I'm seeing here. So they're very financially stable. They are very good at making decisions, especially with justice and judgment. They will always take you into consideration, super committed. Again, they have worked through issues and challenges of the past. They know, I, I, they're very in tune with themselves spiritually, which I see with a hanged man, but also mentally and emotionally. So you know all of the things that you're learning about, well, childhood and how that affects you and healing and spirituality and law of attraction and being a good person in general, they also have learnt all of that, which means the two of you are going to be so aligned, so aligned. You're not going to have to feel that you have to describe to them, you know, what uh, being a consistent person <laughs> is all about. You're not going to tell them like, oh, you know, why why didn't you message me back, um, you know, at so-and-so time? Or why didn't you let me know that this is the case with this? Why are you keeping your emotions to yourself? They're not going to make you feel like that because they're not going to do that towards you because they know what that's like to have that being done to them. The two of you are going to be on the same page at the same time, which means you don't have to emotionally chase them to do things. They will tell you, they will validate your emotions. They will tell you, this is how I feel about you. You know, so very, very healthy. You know, imagine having someone who thinks in a very similar way to you. I'm not saying they are going to be the exact same to you. Okay, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying here that they are very similar to you. Now, what that technically means, okay, is that they think in a very similar way. They are understanding, they're respectful, they're genuine, they're kind, they're caring, you know. Um, that's obviously really important um, and very vital. So, um, should we go with some of these? cards hold on a second i'm trying to yeah let's go with these cards universe is like you know what this person's going to come your way it's your choice whether you entertain them or not but don't ignore them straight away because they they do have a lot to give you and and the more you are healed you know the more they will come to you and it will work in a better way time you are trying too hard give it time yeah give it time okay this person is going to come for some of you who are really desperate where you're like you know what i'm not going to have anyone new in the future so let me just stick with this person who's very hot and cold with me or go back to someone in the past who perhaps didn't really serve me is not treating me very well give it time okay um try not to jump to conclusions here queen of cups here shows that someone who actually values your your mind and your soul and your spirit and your emotions is absolutely going to come. Magician here shows that uh, communication is going to take place and the Eight of Wands shows them actively coming into your life. Okay, so I feel like some of you need to hear this. They will come. Oh, look at that image. When it, matter, uh, when it comes to matters of the heart, there is no right or wrong. Every choice you make expands your understanding of life and love. I mean, yeah, that can kind of contradict what I just said, which is like, oh, you know, you are trying too hard. But it's true. I think that some of you will realize that, you know what, that has made me hold on to things that don't actually serve me. And so what's really interesting here is that it, it does actually help you to expand 
your personal understanding of what cycles you have, what patterns you have, and how that impacts the things you do going forward as well. Um, so that is really what I have right here. Now, of course, if this resonates with you, let me know in the comment section below. I always give an affirmation, um, and the affirmation here very much so is, I won't ignore this person. Now, the reason for that is because you're actually affirming and allowing this person to come into your life. You know, obviously, if you don't want this person to come into your life, then you don't. But this is allowing them to come into your life. This is allowing you to say, you know what? I do want you to come into my life. I do want, you know, I do want to experience this. So that actually allows them to come. So this is your reading. Now, of course, if this resonates with you, let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Check out the description box below for information on personal services, reading giveaway, and of course, intention items, which are on my website. And I will see you all very soon. Bye. Oh, I also have, by the way, TikTok and Instagram if anyone wants to follow me on there. So the links for that are also down below as well. All right, so I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye, everyone.